My name is Yassir Jama. I'm not a random person. I have got a great experience that I have decided to share with you. Why? Because it's time. First of all, I would like to speak about the difference between belly dance as an art and belly dance as a work. When we mention belly dance as an art, it includes such terms artist, choreography, polite attitude, and respectful movement. What it actually means? Bay dancer must perform in a respectable place, such an opera house, event room, and among artistic community. We do speak about belly dance as an art when it happens to be among the people who are passionate about sharing the knowledge and the beauty of the art. Performing in cabaret, cafe, etc. Belly dancer gives an impression of a worker and pity to say, serves as an accessory. For most, because nobody is concentrated and interested, people simply don't give energy back. After the performance, the only feeling is emptiness. Another important element in art is the audience. The real audience is interested in a story you want to share. They are following you and your emotions during all the performance. In this seminar, we are going to talk deeply about belly dance as an art. I have always believed that belly dance can become international art for wider auditory with prestigious way. Due to many years of experience, observation and analysis, I have decided to share my knowledge with you to improve this unique art together. I strongly believe that it can be done in a better way, performed for a better audience, presented with a better image. Belly dance can be an art like any other art. As far as we know, there is a good artist and a bad artist. Being a good one means to do everything in correct, polite and positive way. Being a good artist means to work for a mission, to discuss and spread global ideas, to share positive messages, to inspire active people, to show high level of creativity in a respectful way by keeping the universal principles. It means the center of your activity is not the person itself or his body. In this case, the artist is a good example to follow for people of different cultures, ages, and communities. Here, the artist works for the global minds and everything he does. He does it carefully with the deep process of preparation. Talking about a bad artist, who is it? Is it really a meaning of a bad artist? You will ask. He is an artist, so it's unquestionably a good way already. But my answer is yes, bad artist exists and you should avoid being called so. I will tell you that this artist is not an artist actually. He is just a supplement in everything he does. He works in disrespectful places, in front of shallow people. What he does, it has no purpose and sense. All that he is looking for is to make money for a living. But money shouldn't be a name. In my opinion, these people we can't even call artists because they usually just do in small jobs like animation and short performances to amuse people. They are beneficial for society in an economical way, but in reality not inspiring. So we have got the difference between two types of artists and from now I will concentrate on talking about belly dance as an art and belly dancer as a real artist. I will cover three profiles. Dancer as choreographer and performer, dancer as teacher and coach, and dancer as a student. Three of them are having the same goal they pursue, to be happy, creative, and productive. Three of them want to achieve the same results with passion, from their heart, and with the best way. It means when you dance, you dance beautiful, technically correct, and with respect. Thinking right, rehearsing well, and improving their skills and mental power, these three artists will achieve their goal. We will propose how to do it and we hope you will find an answer to all the questions. When you take up belly dance or any other type of dance, you do it for several reasons. You have a knack for dance and desire to amplify your talent. You want to be a good teacher. You feel your abilities and aspire to open a school, academy, and become a local or even world known. You want to join in dance lessons because you are bursting with energy inside that you want to release. While you are dancing, 
you are happy and relaxed. The stress and strains of your day-to-day -day life and personal problems fade away. Dance helps you to unwind. To dance well, you have to consider three elements. Firstly, step which is meant to be soft and in harmony with space should come at ease and spontaneously. Secondly, movement which needs to be rehearsed until the harmony is reached. Thirdly, combination must be diverse. Every movement and step should logically evolve. You go from step to other step with a logical and progressive way. Here we remind you the difference between these three things. The move is how your body moves. Detailed movements of your limbs, head, even hair. The step is how you conduct this movement. How you spring and stroll on the stage. Your posture, your grace. The combination is an alliance of above mentioned things in harmony. And obviously, the performance must be within production, evolution and end. In the dance field, the choreography is an ensemble of these three things in a harmonious and logical way. To succeed in this technical process of preparation, you have ways. You need to learn basic elements from a teacher, concentrate on techniques, rehearse every day, keep developing your skills until your body feels readiness. The wisdom here is to have a teacher you live up to, but at the same time, you can acquire knowledge from other teachers to learn various styles, methodologies from all possible sources. Frankly speaking, long hard work lies in front of you. But as the proverb goes, no pain, no gain. What you should certainly do is every 3-4 videos you make, you compare whether you are a better version of yourself. The crucial element is to listen to the critics and opinions of people. Even if they are not from the dance field, sometimes the fresh eye can add a value to your performance. If you want to succeed, you need to establish a goal for a short term. 6 months for example. And in 6 months, you do 6 action plans. You need to know clearly what you want to achieve in one month. Simply to cut the task into pieces. Until you find whether you achieve the result or not, it's significant to analyze and recount the obstacles and move forward your aim. If objective is too high and it needs more time, during this time you need to contact coaches who can analyze and guide you to help in goal achievement. But please, remember one thing. It's a serious process that requires time management, mental readiness, challenge facing, and competitive character. Another important element in the process of preparation is to be mentally ready. Most of the people don't succeed because of three kinds of problems. Weak personality, family complications, and professional stress. Talking about personality, we imply these people are having lack of confidence. They are afraid of taking risks and going out from the comfort zone. Sometimes the culture blocks the people due to stereotypes. Many people don't learn because of big ego, which is a dangerous thing. They are sure they are already perfect, but life is never ending path of learning. Keep it in mind. Concerning family problems, in some cases parents or partner or community are disapproving of the new hobby, and the student feels everyone is against him, and thus it affects the mental state. Regarding the professional life, people don't find time because they are overloaded, Negative energy impacts their actions and blocks them in the way of success. Further, we will speak about this deeper. Before you start, you need to eradicate these obstacles. Unbeatable rule number one. Believe in yourself. Observe yourself. Talk to yourself. Analyze yourself. Estimate yourself. And after that, take risks. If you really love what you do, but don't get scared of unknown and daunting. Go for it. Take the plunge. Don't be afraid to take risks because of future life uncertainty. Life without risks has no meaning. Famous proverb says, no venture, nothing have. If you want to become smart and successful, you need to take the responsibility for your actions and go for it with full power. Blockage from the family side comes in a moment when Western people want to do an Eastern dance and faces some stereotypes. But we need to be open to the world as we are all human beings who are living in harmony and peace. Majority of people think dance is erotic. In this case, you need to create communication and dance for the art, for the story. But if you are among tolerant community, your troubles will be resolved. 
the only advice to solve professional problems is to know how to manage time, not to get overload and learn how to let your hair down. Short overview of mental readiness and surely it's a long topic of discussion because most of the people are complex and need deep analysis. But remember all can be resolved by following. Communication to yourself, communication to others and communication to universe. Polite, frank, integrate in the right place with the right person. To be positive is another, I would even say, vital aspect of the preparation process. To smile, to be happy in any matter, to communicate positively, to be kind to people and nature, it will help anyone to learn fast and reach an appropriate result. Because when you are positive, you attract the knowledge instantly. When you listen carefully and grasping information, and memorizing you attract people vibes and your body becomes flexible and develops skills rapidly. Let's talk about how to develop this aspect. Positive attitude is an exercise as any other exercise. In any difficult emotional state, wake up with a smile. Go to sleep with a smile. Good technique is to analyze your day, to analyze exactly all the positive and negative moments of what has happened. When you have any kind of problem, smile. Not only you will feel energized and happy, but also will turn other people into positive mood. Accept anything happens in your life as a test. If you succeed with one, you will have more tests ahead. And that means you are important for the universe. Be happy what you have and be ready for difficult moments and obstacles. Challenges will make you stronger, smarter and wiser. Self-confidence is a key aspect of an art life. When you are on the stage and want to show that you are exceptional, brilliant dancer, you must manage your emotional states, be persuasive in what you are doing. The last element in the process of preparation is energy that you share on the stage. It's a crucial element in art life to share energy. Because all what you do, you do eventually for one thing, to share. Firstly, you have to understand that all your thoughts become actions and all your actions, your attitude. If your thoughts are negative, your actions are also negative and you impact society in, in a productive way. If your thoughts are positive, you spread around positivity and energy and you will attract only life-changing and extraordinary things. I strongly believe that when you communicate with the universe, when you care of environment by protecting trees, flowers, animals, you become automatically full of positive energy. You start living with noble meaning and your existence has sense. So what you get in response is positive energy from flowers, plants, wind breeze, sun rays, and simply beautiful communication. You gradually start to develop in your faith and internal harmony. We are talking about this aspect in a simple way that in details we will discuss in another seminar. Bear in mind one valuable thing. Whenever you are, just be yourself. Be mentally stable strong, positive, and spread positive energy around. If you think this way, listen to your teachers, organize your time, communicate with a good way, rehearse hard and smart with action plans, analyze the difference between what you wanted to do and what you have done. When you have completed all these things with a smile, it means the process of preparation is successfully done. I can guarantee that you are on the right way of exceptional and inspiring artists in belly dance. So I discussed all these details because they are really important. While I was traveling and teaching around the world, I have noticed unhappiness of many dancers as they were completely worn out after many years. As a result, family and professional life were affected. That's why my strong recommendation to take the process of preparation very seriously so you will proceed with the reasonable way. When you are done, you can take the next step, which is the process of the performance. Great performance requires time and preparation. You have to know that whatever you do, you do it for the history, for your own life story. It means that any step you do, you must think about your archives. The way you will look after it after 10 years, will you be proud or not? Your name is your archives. What you have done before, will follow you. Thus, better do it now with the supreme way whether to think after how to modify it later.
Great performance depends partially on a great song. The process of choosing the song must be connected to your personality. Here is an advice. The song should have an intro, development, and end. And of course, the song must be a story, full of different emotions, swinging from sadness to happiness, from happiness to sadness, with drama, energetic parts, powerful snippets. The arrangements must be professional and sound supposed to be clean and clear. Wonderful music is delightful for an audience. Noisy, bad quality music just disturbs the people. You have to know who you are by a music choice. We feel that you are unique. We feel that you are emotional, strong personality, highly talented if the music presents all these characteristics. Always choose what you feel and never go for what others have chosen before. One quality performance per month with good music choice and serious preparation is much better than plenty of meaningless performances. Another important detail is your costume. The colors, the styles, material quality, accessories represent who you are. My recommendation is that the artist will focus on respectful costume with less accessories and less colorful to give space for talent and attention to your dance. The costume should be an accessory, not the main thing. Eye attention shouldn't be drawn only to your clothes. Much better to concentrate on what you are doing, whether your looks. The wisdom is to show art rather than the body. So when you will perform is another crucial element. Great artists always choose great art places where to perform. Theater, opera house, art cafe, art restaurants, art halls. Because when we will see you performing, we will know who you are. The sound of the stage is a significant element in success of your performance. Weak, noisy tone will destroy the audience perception. That's why before any performance you must be sure of sound effects. It must be powerful, clean and modern technology. Always before performance do check in with the sound engineer and verify by your own ear the sound. The lighting is crucial as well. Beauty of your costume, smile, choreography will be more bewitching and prominent with the beauty of the lighting. The choice of light colors must be in harmony with your costume. Light engineer will make your dance more dynamic and charismatic. The topic of lighting is huge and we will get back to it in further seminars. We will talk about music selection, story choice, sound and light. We will give you technical tips. Now we have arrived to a topic of choreography creation. How to make an extraordinary choreo and be impressive on the stage. So far you have already chosen a terrific song and you want to express it. Just imagine yourself as a scenarist who is writing outstanding scenario. Gripping script with an intro, development, and culmination. And various parts. Each part is pierced by the variety of emotions and literally lets shivers down to spine. So the song is like scenario and you have to divide it in different parts. For instance, intro, part one, part two, part three, and culmination. Between each part, there is a transition. That's why I repeat, music selection is vital. After dividing the song and expressing your own story, you will start to choose different actors for your story. Here you will start to make choreo. Here you will apply moves according to parts. It means you will express them in, on each rhythm, lyrics, music, and gradually change. Try going sometimes for lyrics, another minute for rhythms, then for music. Experiment and flow with the creation. Create your own masterpiece. But don't forget to express the transitions too. When you have finished with remarkable choreography, it's time to start your performance. You feel ready mentally and physically. You have got good costume expressing your style and personality. You have chosen wonderful music, rich on emotions, with beautiful arrangements and clean sound. You have done sound check and it was successful. And you agreed with light engineer about the light design on stage. You have brought the scenario. You have chosen actors. You have divided song on different parts. 
you have created the moves, combinations, and your innovative career is done. Eventually, you are on the stage and here your exam is to make all this work successful in life. Remember that audience remembers the artists in three details. How they enter on stage, how they leave the stage, and how they express transitions. Be always smiling, but not excessively, because smile sometimes is a sign of stress. Be communicative on stage, look at the audience, speak to them with no verbal communication, respect them, and let them participate in your show. Reveal them your self-confidence, your uniqueness. Show that your performance is special, creative, inspiring, emotional. Point out that you are the main on the stage. Show that all the things is a result of hard work. So they will dive completely in your story. Show them that you want the best for them. That you are highly talented, concentrated, polite, kind, with a good soul. Persuade them that being like you, they must also work hard because you are a good example to follow. If you share with them your serenity, intelligence, positive energy, high level of creativity, they will feel your emotions, your energy, your importance, and will remember your impressive performance. This would be called a productive result of long process of preparation. Bay Dancer is called a good artist in case when she focuses on a beauty of soul rather than the body. When she concentrates all her mind power on creativity. Smart Billy Dancer is the artist who thinks universally by dancing on modern kinds of music with natural oriental rhythms.